Now I want that drop. Yeah, now I do what I want. 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 Yo, so what is going on guys? TD for 3 here and I'm back again with another NBA 2K18 Pro-Am video. And today as you can see by the title, I'm going to be showing you the best offense to run in NBA 2K18. And it's very simple. Most of you guys know, <coughs> but some of you guys who are watching might not. It's 5 out. So my team previously ran 5 out. I ran on a 6'10 point guard. And as you can see, like it's not very difficult. It's just 5 out along with pick and pop also because you're gonna want to have all shooters you can run five out with pretty much any lineup but if you have the shooters then it makes it that much easier because you don't want to collapse down uh from the shooters and see that's what's happening here i'm just taking the guy off the dribble and no one's helping because why would you want to give up the three so definitely the most overpowered offense in the game it honestly needs to be patched in my opinion but it hasn't been, but as you can see there, we have all the shooters out and my guy's so big and they can't stop me that it's pretty much impossible to stop. This definitely works better if you have a bigger guy, a point guard who can finish well, which is again, like I said, what I have, but I've seen 6'5 players doing it as well. I've seen 6'10 Pierce Sharps doing it. The game is <coughs> broken. Sorry about that. The game is broken pretty much and you get a blow by an animation and you're set as you can see here if you also want to you set screens uh the sharp loops around and they either have to step up on them or they're giving up the layup so like i said this is a very overpowered offense it's a good offense people get mad when people run it but literally everybody's running at this point as you can see right there i set the screen and the roll uh everyone's running at this point so really people just need to get over it but, so this is what I would definitely suggest. Uh, it is very overpowered, again, like I've been saying the whole time. As you can see right there, they're trying to put a center on me, and you just, it's tough. It's tough, because it's either you give up the two every time, or you collapse and you give up a three to 70% three-point shooters. So that's why this offense is so good. I would suggest having a sharp defender or something, because with the pure sharps you're not gonna be able to defend very well and you can't hide on defense this year so definitely would do that and yeah guys that's gonna wrap it up for this video really quick just telling you guys what the best overpowered offense is for some new people who might be watching this um if you want to catch up with the loop definitely run the five out i mean you're gonna have success with it for sure just like everybody else so thank you guys for all the support i'm gonna be uploading daily i can guarantee that i'm gonna be grinding out now so again thank you very much and td for three peace